Hi, everybody. It's Pastor Bill here. I'm glad to be able to be with you. We can't be in church this morning together because somebody got sick and we want to just make sure nobody else catches anything. So we're going to be having church here uh, on TV or on your computer screen like we've done before. So I'm fine and I hope you all are too. Glad to be able to be with you. So we have a special message this morning just for you guys. Uh, and we have another big word today uh, to learn, and it's called generosity. It's a big word, generosity. And that means being generous. Generous is also a big word. But generous and generosity, that's a lot like sharing, which I think you all know about already. Sharing. Sharing is when we have something and somebody else may not have that, so we can give them part of ours. We can share the good things that we have with each other, which is wonderful. Here's a good example. Um, let's say um, I know somebody who doesn't have anything to eat, or maybe you know somebody who doesn't have anything to eat, but I have one of my favorite sandwiches, peanut butter and jelly. See, I have a whole sandwich, but if somebody I know doesn't have a whole sandwich or even part of a sandwich, what can I do if I've got this whole peanut butter jelly sandwich and they don't have any? I can give them part of the sandwich, part of mine. That way we each have something to eat. That's sharing. That's being generous. We don't have to give it to them, but we want to because we love them. We like them and we want everybody to have something to eat. Here's another thing. What if there's somebody who doesn't have any money? And I have, let's see if you can see that. I have here one, two, three, four, five cents, five pennies. I think you can see those. There you go. Okay, so if I'm generous or if I'm sharing, I can give them maybe two pennies. And then maybe I can keep two for myself. And maybe I can give one at the offering plate at church. That's being generous. That's sharing. Here's another one that I bet you didn't, haven't thought of yet. You know, it's getting to be a little bit cold outside because fall is coming, which is one of my favorite times of the year. Look at these. These are socks. These are socks. I have two pairs of socks. One, two. Well, there may be somebody who doesn't have any socks and they need to keep their feet warm. So if I have two pairs, I could give them one of my pairs of socks and that way they would have something to put on their feet to keep them warm too. That's called sharing. That's being generous. Do you know how we know about being generous? Do you know how we know about things like sharing? Well, we know them because we see how God behaves. We see how God acts. And God acts with generosity. God acts in generous ways to us. God shares with us. You can see that if you look around this afternoon or tonight or maybe tomorrow too. We can see how God is generous. When we look out the window or when we go outside, we can look up and we see the sky, the beautiful sky and the sun. We can look and see trees and grass. God made those things and God shares them with us. God didn't just keep them all to himself. God loves us and God wants to share those things with us. God also made old puppies, and kittens, dogs and cats and all kinds of wonderful things. So God shares those with us. He didn't have to, but he wants to because God loves us. So that's how we learn. And that's what we learn. That's how we learn what we should do. 
we do what God does with the things we have. We share them and we are generous. We are generous and we share with others because we love them and we want them to know that God loves them too. What a wonderful lesson. I'm glad to be with you all. So before we go, let's have a quick prayer. If you will fold your hands like this and bow your heads and close your eyes and then repeat after me. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for being generous with us. Thank you for sharing with us. And please help us to be generous and to share with other people. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, everybody, I'm glad to see you or be able to be with you this way. Can't wait to see you in person again. Have a great afternoon.